Holland taking on South Africa at the 2023 World Cup. This was a magic game, a fantastic game, and it had everything. And it was back and forth, back and forth, attacking, thrusting football all game long. And if you're one of those people that is still sitting on the fence, that you don't really have any time for women's soccer or the women's game. Well, this was certainly one of those games that could make you turn that corner and start to become one of the fans of the women's game. Getting into the game itself, Holland take command of the game and looking really impressive as they have done so far all through the tournament. But also, South Africa would show lots of skill on the ball and lots of fight and lots of enthusiasm that would keep them in this game. But on eight minutes, it goes all south side for South Africa as Jill Rood gets an easy header from two feet out. How could you miss? Take a look at the pictures simply in heaven. Eight minutes in, it could have got better after 25 and it should have got better. Van den Donk should have put it away, but a point blank save from Kaylin Swart in net for South Africa would deny on 25. And you've got to say Kaylin Swart in goal would keep South Africa in this game. And what a physical game it would be as well. You've got to say unfortunate scenes throughout the first half as you see Sion Puenze and Umbani getting stretched off really sad scenes and it took a long time for that to be taken care of sad scenes but it was a physical battle and I'm going to make a point it wasn't a dirty game it was a thrust cut and thrust fast style football match and both teams will go into it at the half it's 1-0 to Holland but South Africa is still exciting with the counter-attacks on the second half gets kicking off 55 minutes in we don't have to wait long Lika Martin scores but it's offside 67 minutes though Swartz Howler in goal after a Bierenstein super super strike on net but Swart has it go through her hands. It's 2-0, and it's 2-0, and it's definitely Holland going through. And again, Holland would put the ball in the back of the net on 79. And it's again that girl, Bierenstein, who for me was the woman of the match. But again, another offside goal. So it finishes on the day 2-0 to Holland. It could have been four. It could have been worse. But woman of the match is absolutely Bierenstein from Holland. Holland looking impressive. For my money, Holland look final bound there you go on the day 2-0 fantastic game and like i say if you're sitting on the fence this could be the game that might turn you into a fan of the women's game